Welcome to the Quick and Dirty with Doc. I'm Dr. Keelan Redmond, and I'm here to give you a little bit of information about a small portion of equine veterinary medicine. Today is part one of our three-part series on equine skin disease. Today is lesion identification, also known as what the is that on my horse's skin. This is rain rot. It's a bacterial infection of the skin. These are the characteristic paintbrush lesions, a chunk of skin with some hairs attached. You can see it come off on grooming tools. You can see it come off on your hands, on the horse's blankets. It's these chunks of skin and hair mixed. They don't necessarily have to have been out in the rain to get rain rot. They can get it for a multitude of reasons and sometimes kind of for no reason at all. This is the exact same horse clipped. Everybody looks at this horse and thinks it's hives and it's not hives. These are those same paintbrush lesions, but the hair is short so it doesn't look exactly the same. You see how the skin is scabby and bumpy? That's what makes it different from hives. This is hives. The bumps are of varying sizes and the skin itself is smooth. This is a true case of hives. This is not hives. This is a clipped horse with rain rot. This is also not hives. This is not hives either. Scratches. This is the scabby, oozy dermatitis that happens down low on the legs. This is a moist, pussy, don't try to spell that, condition that occurs mostly on the fetlocks and pasterns. leg scurf and cannon bone crud. This is a lovely little mixture of pea, dirt, fungus, and bacteria. It's different from scratches because it's not scabby and the lesions don't go as deep. You'll see it a lot right there on the fronts of the hind cannon bones. This next is a highly specialized diagnosis known among experts as equine facial schmutz. This is this inexplicable hair loss over the horse's face. We see it mostly in the summertime, and it usually has a greasy, blackish debris in it. There's a lot more out there about equine skin disease. This is just enough to make you dangerous. Tune in next time.